Oh, mama, doctor, give an old man water to drink. Hey! So, if I give you this my precious water, eh? You will drink of it. Because of my daughter. Shut up, you stupid old man. Who is your daughter? Who? Would you leave this foolish old man? Instead of walking to your grave, you're here, obstructing the stream path. You go. Go to your grave, go. Hola. Hola, let's go. Can't you see this man need help? Must you help him? Must you help him when neither of us helped him? You don't even know if he's a wizard. Only one partner like you will render such useless help. Let's go. Sorry, oh, sorry. Hey, um, do you have a cup? No, no, my daughter. No. So how am I going to help you? Please. Okay, don't worry, you drink from my pocket, oh? Drink, yeah. Your pocket. But won't it? You said you're thirsty and you need to drink water, right? And I'm offering you water, so don't worry, just drink from me. Drink. Drink. Are you okay now? Thank you, Mom. Thank you. You will grow older. Thank you, Mom. Thank you. Invited me. Hey! Chineke. God. Amaka. Did you invite an outcast to your house? I only wanted her to join us, prepare for the maiden dance. Hey! hey! Do you know this girl? She's going mad. Exactly. So you don't know? that she cannot partake in the dance at all. Talk less of wiggling her waist for the prince to see and choose as a queen. You surprise me, Amaka. One day, you will invite the millipede into your own house too. It was pity that made me do it. Pity? My father is dead too and I feel her pain. Your father is dead, but you're not an outcast like her. Eh? It is better to be fatherless than to be an outcast. Eh, one factor. Olama, get out of here. Just go and leave us there. Why do you always despise me? Hey! Why are you always where you're not wanted? Why? Oh, no. Hey! 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 I'll talk to them. Ah, Andrea. Go and leave us there. No. How are you girls? Muria is not fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. What's wrong? You. You are out of the game. Now. Girls are not out of the game. Can you go? Mama, 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 what is it? Mama, you tell me. 
tell you what. Why am I so cursed? Why am I Nwakbata? What is the meaning of Nwakbata? Mama, you have to tell me today. I need answers. I can't go on anymore. I, I can't cope with this. I have been scorned all my life. We are not originally from Afa. So where are we from? And why shouldn't we go back there? We are from Omoka, a town not of Afa. People known for their hunting skills. They had the secret of catching wild animals. They dug trenches and covered them with leaves and grasses. Unsuspecting animals fell into them and got trapped. So, one day, a cow that belonged to a pata deity in Afa lost its way and fell into the Omoka trap. Knowing fully well it was not a wild animal, they gave deaf ears, slaughtered and ate the meat instead of looking for the owner. So what happened? A few months later, the rot of Apata fell on the people of Omoka. People died in their numbers. Mm. Men, women, even children. The oracle demanded for a virgin in replacement of the slain cow. And we are the descendants of that virgin. That's why we are called Omoabata Us. A virgin for a slain cow? She was never married. She was seen as a taboo. And the men, being men, did besiege her at night. And she ended up the mother of many children. And her children also, the mothers and fathers of many. We are her descendants. Was that? How Arinze and I were born? Oh, I, I see. I see. We are not good for marriage, but good for abuse. To bring forth unfortunate children to share the same fate. by the soul of that virgin was brought into this town as an unwilling ransom. And by the sufferings that women like you have been through in this town, that no one, I mean not anyone, I shall keep it until the day I die. Stop! Stop it! Stop it! You don't make such vows. It could be dangerous. The real danger lies in giving birth to a child. Having her go through the kind of humiliation that I go through this minute. Life is a great experience. Whatever happens, we have a lot to live for. Yes. That's for me. Eh? Olama. Olama. Hey! Agaba, 
Your Highness. Excuse us. Yes, Your Highness. Okay, sir. I have fixed the maiden dance for the next three market weeks. Father, I already told you I'm not interested in that kind of stuff to beat my queen. I have to you, Biazza. I did not send you to London to imbibe the white man's culture hook, line and sinker. I know, Father. And that's why I did not return with the white lady I fell in love with. That would have been an abomination, a taboo. Father, Julia gave me more love more than any black African deserved. Now, if there was anyone committing an abomination or a taboo, it was her. Enough of that nonsense. I married your mother through the maiden dance. Well, times change, Father. Yes, times do change. But not in the traditions of Afanasa. And not in the palace of Igwe Dike Ikenga, the unbottled Jumbo of Afanasa. You are going to take a wife according to our own traditions and customs. Go for the dance, like every other maiden in this. We don't belong with them, eh? The ghosts will visit us with rot if you go. I know, I... I just wish I could go. Don't think about it. It hurts more when you do. Please come back into the house, oh? So that you will not hear the sounds of the drum so much. No. I wish to be here. Let me suffer here. Let the gods see me suffer. And in seeing me suffer, let them rebuke themselves for creating an innocent lineage and calling them Wangwata. I wish to be a thorn in the flesh of the gods.
before your very eyes and in the presence of all our visitors, my son, the prince and heir to the throne, Chukudi Obiese has found himself a queen! Father, what have we done? I mean, what have we done? I stand in front of this house every day, and in front of the statue of the Virgin Mother Mary, which my mother put there as a symbol of her Christian belief before she died, and yet you still uphold this barbaric culture? I mean, forcing me to choose a wife from a dance and not love? Son, we have to walk the tightrope of living in the modern world. And mentored your cultures. You give to God, God, and see to Caesar, Caesar. It is my responsibility as a traditional monarch to maintain the roots of our tradition, our cultures handed over to us from generations past. The girl will be good for you. She'll make you happy. Look, Father, still I'm not happy. I mean, the, the one I found for myself, she didn't come to the dance. The one you found for yourself? Found for yourself where? Father, some things are still better left unsaid, even between father and son. <laughs> well, if she was not at the dance, then she's not a virgin. Look, I married your mother, Lolo, as a virgin. My father married my mother as a virgin. You have a virgin waiting for you out there. Why brood over nothing? Oh, I... I guess I'll just make do with what's available then. Exactly. Exactly. If so. and enjoy the delicious meal very carefully prepared for you by your very thoughtful ancestors. Yeah. How benevolent could one's ancestors be? Princess Anne. First of all, she is not my friend. Secondly, she is no virgin either. Uh -uh. Are you certain she is no virgin? No, yeah. She used to be my friend. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Virgin.
So how do you find your new home? It's beautiful, my lord. It's like heaven. It's wonderful. I love everything. Well, this used to be my mother's private chamber. And you have been favored to inherit it. Thank you, my lord. Oh, yeah. Yes, my lord. I must tell you that though I picked you, it was because a choice must be made. It was never my stuff to grab a wife just like picking an orange from a store. I had viewed marriage from a simple viewpoint. Which is, my lord? Which means that I prefer we take some time to study each other properly. No need to rush in things. I will not be touching you for now. I'd prefer you take some time to fit into your new environment first. Anything you say, my lord. Very well then. Um, another thing. I was told that all the girls who performed at the dance are all virgins. Now how true is that assertion? Very true, my lord. Don't be surprised. That is the proper treatment a queen deserves. Enjoy your meal. We'll continue our talk later. It's so beautiful out here. Yes, it is meant for the royal class of which you're now part of. So tell me, um, how do you see the sky? It's beautiful. Much more attractive, my lord. Attractive? You believe my prince and my lady. Now you see, um... So, um, see, being in this palace, you have to learn certain etiquettes. My late grandfather, the past Igwe, was a very principled man. And from generation to generation, a certain rule has been very your Highness, your father needs in the palace immediately. If you'll excuse me. Of course, my lord. Stand by my lady. Yes, your Highness. What is it? What is what? What are you staring at like that? And how did you know that I stared at you? Where are you staring at me? No, don't be stupid, Akaba. I warn you, stay away from my marriage. I warn you. I warn you, stay away from my marriage. I warn you. Thank you. 
she come? You know, human beings are unpredictable. Maybe yes, um, maybe no. But I sent her a message through a palace servant to meet us here. So maybe let's wait. Or could she be facing difficulties? Difficulty, my foot. The palace servants have been sending countless goods to her parents as tribute. Look who is coming. Wow, look at her steps. Don't they remind one of Muria? It's not possible she could come out alone without the palace servants following. <laughs> I missed you too. I told you people, it's her steps. I get there, we. So you don't give me away. I actually split out of the palace. Mm -hmm. You must go somewhere else. Mm -hmm. This way. We need to talk. Fashioned print protocols and put in green. Really? Ah. Hey! Alas! <laughs> but <laughs> before you rejoice too much, I have a problem. Hmm. Agaba, Ziba drain you. <laughs> what has he done? If Agaba is the problem, get your husband to sack him immediately. Agaba's case isn't all. My husband, the prince, actually believes that I am still a virgin. That means he has not slept you yet. Yes. He insists that he wants us to get to love each other naturally first. The prince is a wonderful man. And I wouldn't want to lose him. But every day I fear that he might want to have me and subsequently discover that I am not a virgin. My friends. My friend. What can you think of to help me out of this situation? Please. This is no easy, Maria. I have an idea. What is that? Yes. Relax. Relax. We shall be killing two birds with one stone. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Listen. When you get home, take Agaba to a lonely place. Eh? Let him think you want to talk things over with him. Then tear your dress and shout for help. Hmm. Cry seriously and make everyone believe that he raped you. Hmm. Oh, Jesus, hmm? that is not right. You're just trying to frame the poor man up. Ah, oh, it's not fair. Hmm. That's exactly the solution. Or do you have another? Hmm. Hmm? I don't care if she has another. I like this one. Good. Then Igwe will then punish Agaba for defiling the land. And then the prince will have you and think he lost your virginity to a rapist. <laughs> exactly, my dear. You girls, put me out of this. Mm. I'm not part of you. Mm. Please. <clears throat> My friends, mm -hmm. Uju, yes. Ijoma, mm. what is it? What would I have done without you? Nothing. You know, this is the reason why I want both of you in the palace with me. Yes. Hmm. And as for you, I shall have my eyes on you. Thank you. I'll always be watching out Thank for you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Hey, <laughs> What? The money is my own, though. Not for you. Share which money? I thought you wanted to. I'm not giving anybody the money if we should go. I'm staying here. 
Go. It's my money. Hey, young lady. Young lady. Stop. Who, me? Perhaps you can see there's no other person here. I realize your name is Ola. Yes, I... I am a Lama. Thanks for knowing my name. Wait. I've not finished with you yet. And what is remaining? Don't sound like that, my dear. You're such a beautiful young girl that any able-bodied young man will keep on recollecting that inside of you. Thanks for the compliment. Is there anything else? Mm, it's unfortunate you're from the doomed family. Hola there. A beautiful girl like you is not supposed to be in such an ugly situation. Just listen to me and I will change your fates. Have you finished? There's no other thing left for me to say. Just think about it. Thank you. Hola. Hola. Yo, are you walking out on me? Asafa! The chief got of the palace. Idiot. You're not an inch. I said you're not an inch! Bigger than every other girl I've come across in this village. We shall see if I don't end up having you. Yes, you did, Mary. I'm sorry I'll pay for it. Now close your eyes. Why, my lord? Am I better off blind? I have a surprise for you. Okay. You're close. What is it like? Just be patient. You told me you were a virgin. You just 
Скажи мне. Отцап. Why would you want to bring shame to this dynasty? Speak! I will speak. I will speak my love. Мне в чем я сказала. Она будет пересечена до конца. Смотрите, у меня страх от того, что пощупается. Потому что то, что я не знаю, я не знаю. Talking to a doubt. You've obviously been at it more than once. No, no, my lord. No, my lord. Enough. First day tomorrow morning, you shall pack all your belongings and leave the palace. It shall be assumed that she's like you are not killing me. No, my lord. I thank you, my lord. Don't. Father, I bring you news of Oria. Oria, your wife? News? I'm listening. Father, she's no longer my wife, for I have sent her packing back to the filthy environments from where she came. What? How could you take such a decision without first telling me? Father, the position of the queenship of this great dynasty cannot be left in the hands of an adulterous woman. That? She was supposed to be a virgin, remember? Yes. She took part in the dance of the virgins. There's a big difference, Father, between taking part in the dance for virgins and actually being a true virgin. Mm -hmm. For the first time last night, I went into her. And I noticed everything in there was nothing but loose and filthy. What? Yes, father. You know I never supported getting a wife in such an arrangement, but I had to do so because it was your own idea. Good here. And I don't trust filthy serpent? A deceiver of the worst kind? Could she do that to a prince of the kingdom? This is unbelievable. It is unimaginable. That girl is not fit to be married by anybody within the clans of Afanasa. That is also a tradition. She should go and live far away in those lands where they treat women as scum and serpents. One of whom she, she is. No, it is unfair for her to do this. I shall so decree that she never gets married by any man in this kingdom. That would be a good punishment at least.
ruins them. Is that how to sweep? Hey! Come and sweep this place. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, Mama me, I'm tired though. I'm not a girl. Hey! Mama, I believe the other girls would have left the stream by now. You know how they treat me. <laughs> I just wish I could keep avoiding them. Don't worry. I won't be long, oh? Please, don't be. Hmm? Because we're heading for the farm on your return. And keep avoiding those girls. Please. Bye bye. Eh? Be fast. Arinze. See your back now. Are you not going to fetch firewood? Not yet. I don't want to run into Nuria and her friends. So when do you want to go? At night? We still have time before night falls. <laughs> okay. Let me ask you. Are you going to run away from this village because of them? Hmm? You can't continue like this now. I don't go now. Um, well, I think you've got company now. What? Yes, I'll, I'll escort you to the farm. Why? You don't even know me. Listen, I know you. You're the one who doesn't know me. So who are you? Well, I'm, I'm someone who wants to escort you to the farm. Yeah. So bad, you want to escort me?
let my water leave in room. Eh? You're going to pluck out all the water leaves here. These small, small ones are the weeds. If you can't do it, leave it all. all right, I'm sorry. You know, I could do this with you every day. Who is this? Hola, Mama. Charibe. My prince. Hey, what? Hola, Mama. What is it? Please, please, Don't please, leave my please, prince. Please, 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 stop. Don't panic. Please, oh, please. Stop it. Stop it. My prince. What is this now, Mama? What are you doing? Farming in the farm of Mwapata. Hi! Look, stop this, please. Are you still standing? Didn't you recognize him again? The prince, the only head to the throne of Alpha. Hi. Oh. Please, 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 please stand up. Please, leave us alone. Eh? Hey. Hey. Why did you bring him here? Mama, Mama, it's not my fault now. I didn't know he was the one. I've never seen him before. Uh, that faithful day by the stream. Stream? Yes. The old man you gave water by the stream. Are you okay now? Thank you, Mom. Yes, that was me in disguise looking for my queen. But when you didn't come to the maiden dance, I became frustrated. So I ask you now, why didn't you show up? I couldn't come. She was ill, malaria. Talk of fate. I mean, a thing as simple as malaria almost denying a prince his worthy queen. Listen, I had to pretend, you know, since it was very evident you didn't recognize me as the prince of Afanasa, so I wanted to know you more. But your mother's sudden appearance has halted all my pretenses. Well, I'll say she's late. Because I've seen enough to make me know that I did not make a mistake the first day. You've never made a bigger mistake, oh. Prepare yourself. Go home. Come meet me under the Udala tree. I shall be waiting to take you to my father. Why did you lie to him? Me, I'm not going anywhere. Huh. Are you starting off that? Mama. It is obvious he doesn't know who we are. The minute he realizes what we are, he will wash off his hands and his legs and take to his heels. <laughs> what is it now, Mama? Won the princess heart and would have become the queen of Alpha. But look, look at the wicked tradition. Hmm. Did I not tell you that I was going to die a virgin? Live long, my king. So will you after me, my son. Father. I found her. Really? Where? In this afar, father. Uh -huh. Then where is she? Well, I waited for her all afternoon yesterday, but she never showed up. You mean she had the guts to keep you waiting? The, who is this vagabond? Tell me the name of the family and I'll send guards to go and confiscate all their property immediately. No, father. Did she not know you are the prince of Afa? She knew, but um, she kept away for good reasons, I presume. What, what good reasons? What good reasons? Nobody. Nobody has the right to keep my son waiting. 
let alone a girl who has to stoop down to your head. Now, come on, we'll go. Time for action. Guards! Prepare for action. Yes. Yes, Your Highness. Say, and I say, no, Father. Oh, be sir. You are the prince of Hafa. But I am the king. And when I say action, then action it is. Come on. Father, aren't we talking about my wife here? You know, the queen to be. That is the more reason why we take... Father, don't you think any woman who should be the queen of Hafa and Asa should have a mind of her own? Ooh. Father, I found myself a woman of substance. A woman of character. A woman who has enough will to call the bluff of a prince who tried to intimidate her. Give her some guts. Her personality, Father. She perfectly understands her quality. And that's why she wouldn't sell her dignity that cheap. Allow me woo her, Father. She deserves nothing less. I have no more good to offer to the palace. Well, I'm here for something far bigger than a goat. I knew you were a woman of character, but I never believed you could stand the prince of Afar Nassar up. Get up. There's no need for that. May you live long, Your Highness. Get up. I have come to my queen since she has been avoiding me. Your Highness, this can't be the girl you're talking about. And why not? Does anyone in this village compare to her beauty? But, but she is a... Seal your lips on this matter, Akaba. Yes, Your Highness. Off you go to the palace. Yes, Your Highness. Well, I'm here today, so it's either you go in, prepare yourself so I can take you to the palace, else I wait here till the sun rises for yet another day. Can someone get me a seat? Olama, I am waiting. The girl who shunned the prince? Father, please. That was some risk you took, young lady. But my son insists you are the one he wants. 
expressly so far. I will go ahead and give my blessing. Do I? Of course, Father. There's no one else but her. May the spirits of our ancestors, the gods who oversee the Ikenga of Afanasa, purify you for the challenges towards the throne as the queen of this great land. You see. You see. Thank you, Your Highness. that I'll cast. Since the prince rejected me because I am not a virgin. Thanks to you, he must never meet her a virgin. And what if he has already eaten from her pot of ora soup that is in between her legs? I know the prince. He always takes his time. How can I ever thank you? What do you want? Name it. <laughs> 